the back. You want to cook it so it's a nice golden brown there, so the butter's nice and lightly burnt, not, you know, actually like black or anything like that, even though, you know, some people like it that way. Of course, something that tastes like garbage, but that's what you get the cheese so it's nice and melted, it's lifting up off there, you can see the pesto's all up in it, and you just take it off, make sure you turn off your oven, don't want any fires, take that off the heat, serve it on a nice little plate, all it's done. Boom, done with that, pull out our knife, I for one am more fond of the triangular cut. How do you cut your sandwiches there, Mike? Uh, in a dinosaur shape. In a dinosaur shape. <laughs> that's, uh, that's not surprising. They sell it at Walmart. And then you just cut it in half here. Yeah. You can see how nice and melted that cheese is all in there. Just want to come right off. I mean, Mike, you do the honors, bro. Oh, okay. Um, some of you requested to see us take the bite, and uh, here it goes. Mm. Mm. That's quite good. Mm. You know, the first thing that hits your mouth is that basil, because it's like pop. Mm. But then it's like a smooth spice coming from that pepper jack cheese. And I mean, it's quite lovely. It's also good if you cook it with some spinach in there, too. Mmm. Good that cheese. See how lovely that cheese is? Mm. <laughs> oh. Man. Oh. Well, thank you guys to uh, seeing me, Mike's Kitchen, at Trent's Kitchen.